With the Cebus Touch, we also have replaced the hotkey system. The hotkey system has now been fully integrated into the Cebus Touch screen. So to call up the hotkey menu, we can use one of three options. We can press the hotkey button on the screen, which will highlight our menu. We can also press the hotkey button on our Cebus control terminal. And we can also press the hotkey button on our C motion lever if that has been specced. To access the menu and make settings, we can simply touch on the menu with that highlighted. We can then do our plus and minus adjustments here. And when we are complete, we can hide the menu again. With the last function selected, it will be displayed on the bottom status bar of the machine. And as required, you can touch this option and make your adjustments accordingly. When using the Cebus control panel to access the hotkey, press the hotkey button, which calls up the hotkey menu. You can use the rotary dial to select the required function. Press to enter. When the required function is selected, adjustments can be made using the rotary dial. And whenever the adjustment has been finished, use the back key to exit the menu. When using the C-Motion lever, the system is exactly the same as physically touching the screen. Press your hotkey button to call up the menu, use your up and down buttons to select the required function and the toggle switch on the front of your joystick to make the required changes. From factory your hotkey will come pre-programmed with your spout up and down, your working speed slash half throttle speed adjustment, your header height adjustment, auto contour adjustment, partial width adjustment, cruise control set speed and your horn activation. To make changes to this display we can enter the settings menu, select the favourites management menu and then we can customise the assignment of the hotkey. One thing to note is position 1 is in the middle and the relevant functions fanning out after that. To set the function, simply select the position and assign the function as required. Once the required function has been found, select and that will now be saved in your assignment. Other settings to your hotkey, you can change the display period and you can also reset everything back to factory settings with the touch of a button.